Here we are. Steam message. Missions canceled until further notice. <laughs> Whoops. Good job. Good job, guy. Anyway, yes, welcome back. Uh, hello, everybody. Welcome back to the library. Uh, library cards collect here. We're coming back to part two of Broken Age. We are, uh, we just finished our first mission. We finally broke the system. We broke our regular, uh, reg we broke our schedule. We broke our routine. And we picked up uh, this strange key. Screwed everything. It looks like a weird little screwdriver. So, yes. Uh, beyond that, now everything's canceled, so I gotta find some stuff to do. It's still night. Ooh. It's a tank of compressed air. I think I could be useful in an emergency. I think emergency. I broke my mom. Uh, I haven't. I think she's supposed to wake me up. Yeah, right. Like we have those. Oh gosh. Anything can happen. We met a creepy fox dude last time too. So I think, I think this episode is gonna revolve around finding him. It's a tank of compressed air. Could be useful in an emergency. Yeah, right. Like, we have those. Alright, let's see. Can we can we leave this door? What's this? I want to check the grate first. Hmm. The air vent is screwed shut with these weird little screws. I've got a screwdriver. Alright, I'll remember. I'll make a note to come back here because I want to see if I can get out first. It's locked. What a dirty trick. Hey. What are you doing out of bed, Buster? What am I? Your prisoner? Just until I'm sure you're safe. You have no idea how important you are, Shay. <sighs> and you do? That old man. I am in prison. I'm definitely in prison. I am 1,000% in prison. That's not good. That's not good at all. Dude, I'm getting the heck out of here. It works. No, hmm. keep the key, keep the screwdriver, dude. What are you What are you doing? Where'd it go? Don't just throw stuff like that away, dude. We're gonna need that later. I'm sure of it, and you won't have it anymore. You've doomed us all. What's this? It looks like an inflatable raft. It looks like an inflatable raft. Well, you don't raft. say. Oh, well, hey, I wonder what I could use a, a can of compressed air on an inflatable raft for. Maybe this air tank has enough pressure to blow up this raft. Whoa. It looks like a blow-up doll of me. <laughs> yeah, very. Why is that hiding in that vent? Why am I so fat? Ugh. I'm going to call him Little Lazy Me. I mean, thank you, but it's a little. I don't know if this is gonna fool my mom. He's gonna pick me up and pop me. Hopefully, this looks enough like me to fool the warden. I mean, they accepted the blanket, so. All right. Okay, we know the door is kind of bunk. Uh, oh, yes. Where's my little angel? Oh, there he is. Oh, I think I almost lost you today. Sleep tight, little hero. Hero. Man, computers are stupid. They just have bad face recognition software. You don't know what year this is. Lay off. Don't be mean. Ooh. Where am I? Whoa. How have I never seen this part of the ship before? You came because you are done with children's games. Yes. Who are you? My name is Marek, and what I'm about to show you is no game. While you've been drifting through the universe, eating ice cream, 
playing with trains. War has been raging across the galaxy. War? Between who? Between the forces that every war is between. Between the powerful and the weak, the tyrants and the innocent. But who? Does it even matter? There will always be war. We did not start it, and we cannot stop it. What we can do is protect the weak and rescue the helpless. Look at this distress signal I just received from a peaceful colony in the Talon Nebula. The helpless creatures you see have been imprisoned by forces of tyranny and may soon be executed. But... Yes? We... We have to save them. Yes. Yes, we do. I'm pleased you feel as such. We have to go tell the ship's computer. No. You must tell no one on this ship what I have just told you. This ship is programmed with one function. To keep you safe. Yeah, I noticed that. To help these creatures, you will need to put yourself at risk in a way she could never understand. No, you're right. She would never understand. So what can we do? First, we have to get to the Talon Nebula. Take this star chart to the navigation room. I have an earpiece for you to wear, so we can stay in contact. Use that vent to avoid detection. Return immediately after you're successful. But quickly, young cub, we don't have much time. Dude, I don't think he's a good guy. He's giving me some... He's giving me some pretty shady vibes, and I don't think it's just because of his character design. Those poor creatures. They're counting on you, young cub. Why does everyone want to be my parent? <laughs> time to save some helpless creatures. Do not touch those until I tell you that it's time. You're a weenie. I apologize. It's just that I build them myself, and I'm a little protective. What's that? He's got security cameras everywhere. Only for your protection. Mm hmm He's a devil agent! Oh, that's why! He said don't use- I'll use the door. Let's use the door. This door is locked. This is a stealth mission. Not safe to use the hallways, understand? Oh man, I don't trust him, but I feel like it's what we're supposed to do. This is the star chart for Talon Nebula. Hey, what do you know? It's Talon. Alright. Come at me, game. Let's see what you got. Ah, the young master has come to play with the space weaver. Where shall we go today, wise commander? Oh man, a real mission for once. This is so fun. This is serious, Shay. Stay focused. You can hear everything I say? Yes. Please don't say anything embarrassing. I'll say all the embarrassing things I want. Excuse me. This guy, for example, looks like a spaghetti squid. Where are we? The same place as always. The center of the universe. What? Really? Wherever the young master is, that is the center of our universe. Uh, oh, that's a lot of pressure. I'm kind of creeped out, man. Mm. Hey, Space Weaver, let's go somewhere exciting for a change. I have been programmed to take the young master wherever he desires, as long as it is safe and free of conflict. Aww. Bring me a star chart. And the fabric of time and space shall be knit to serve your passage. Dude, you make tapestries to travel places? That's pretty awesome. Here's a star chart, bro. Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? That is an easy one for the Space mm -mm. Weaver. <laughs> Methinks the Space Weaver weaves space to weave his own space. Space Weaver is the Weaver of Space. And wolf drive. Intake calibers in position. Weave thrusters at viscosity. Spindle at rotational velocity. Deploying nav scarf in five. 
Should I just do I just Two. should I not? One. Rock on! This looks like the place. We totally made it. We absolutely made it. What's down here? What's this thing? If I give the space weaver a star chart, he'll weave the destination pattern into this nav scarf. It's oh man, it's gonna be so long by the end of this. Oh, that'd be awesome. People are absolutely gonna make scarves of that. Negative. This door is locked. All right, you, you large, furry, mammalian, scary wolf thing. I did your job. We should be in the Talon Nebula now. Great work, young cub. We're approaching the location of the distress signal now. <gasps> this is worse than I thought. The good news is their captors have left them unguarded for the time being. What can I do? Here, take these controls. You need to lower the shields so the boom arms can be extended. Oh, okay. Uh, Go on, lower the uh, shields. Green button. Good. Now wait until the boom arm is correctly positioned uh, above the arm. subject. Then. I got it. Great work, Shay. Now the boom arms will haul it in and place it in the auxiliary cargo hold. I should go see if it's okay. No. They must remain in complete quarantine for their own protection. And That's our. shady. You mean our diseases might kill them? You are wise for such a young cub. Now we must save more quickly before their captors return. Save more. Save more. Use the movement controls to position the ship. I can't tell you which creature to save. Look into your heart, young cub. Got another one. Great. Now just place it in the cargo hold and... Oh no. What is it? Hostile forces have been detected nearby. They're coming in our direction. We need to retreat. Not yet. There's still one more to save. No time. We have to pull out immediately or we'll be destroyed. No! You didn't tell me I'd have to pick who lived and died. You want to be a grown-up? Get used to making tough decisions. No time to mourn. There's another distress signal. This one's from Danger System 5. Are you up to it? Shay, are you the master of your feelings or are they the master of you? Give me the star chart. I turn into an okay guy. I don't know if this is a good idea. He's still really shady. This is the star chart for Danger System 5. Looks like a donut to me. Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? Not a problem. Preparing decryption mechanism. Initializing warp and wolf drive. Intake calipers in position. Weave thrust. I don't know why I left there. Oh. Okay. We should be in danger oh. system five. Are we ever? Take Are we ever? Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, oh. Uh. Excellent. 
securing subject and cargo holds. Ah, oh, no, I missed. Ah. Rats. Keep trying. Great work. Ah. Dang. Ah, uh, no. Rats. No. Ah. I thought it was going to go the other way. That's okay. Ah. Try again. Good. But hurry, we're running out of time. Don't wait. Okay, that's enough. What do you mean, that's enough? I mean, enemy ships are approaching. I don't see anything. I need to save this last one. You're going to endanger the whole mission to save one creature? Just give me a second. This is a waste of time. There is no need for this. Okay, I got it. But something's wrong. Cut it loose. We need to retreat before... Attention! Ship is under attack! What happened? Probably one of the enemy vessels I warned you about, remember? We need to get that last creature. Too late. The ship is retreating under autopilot to a safe location. And we're completely locked out of the controls. Gah. How are we going to perform any more rescues? We'll have to find another way to hack into the boom arm controls. And another way to bring the shields down at the right time. And who knows if we'll be able to navigate to the right system now that the ship's on high alert. The ship's computer must be freaking out right now. Oh, yes. <laughs> as soon as the alarm sounded, the first thing she probably did was check on you and your... Shay! Shay! Are you hurt? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Don't worry, sweetie. Um, something attacked the ship, but Mommy's taking care of it. Nothing to worry about, okay? Ah, <sighs> oh, so brave. <clears throat> she thinks I've been sleeping this whole time. How is that brave? Dude, I'm sorry I haven't been talking too much. I've been in, like, shell shock. I real I'm getting so many bad vibes from this guy. It's not even... I don't think we're here. Is better get back to Mary. I don't think. I think. Plan. I think we're abducting people. I don't want to abduct people. That's like not good. Ship under attack. Everything's fine. That's two things that don't go together. Um. Can I leave? Can I? Young cop, you must come see me Stop right Stop looking at me with those eyes. Another distress signal has arrived. Now that you are hunting things, I don't want to hunt things with you. Dad? 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 Wait. Uh, fine. I'll, I'll help your stupid... I'll help you... Dad. I saw my dad there. I know I did. I really, I don't think this is... Any luck with the ship's controls? No, but we intercepted a new distress signal, this time from Prima Doom. How are we going to get control of the ship's cargo boom arms? We'll need to attempt a manual override. The manual boom arm controls are located here. You can get to them through the ship's airlock here. I've hacked the airlock door so you can now open it without alerting the over mother. How are we going to take down the shields? I have a plan. The shields require so much power, they have a dedicated source. This fusion orb. 
Take this Omicron inhibitor and place it over the fusion orb. And when the time is right, we'll turn it on and turn off the fusion orb. Along with the ship's shields. Got it. The distress call was from Prima Doom? How do we get there? Same as always. Take this star chart to the Space Weaver and hope for the best. I don't like this. I don't... So, how long have you been living in here? I am a recent stowaway. I came because I sensed you were ready. Uh-huh. Are you really a wolf? No, I wear this disguise to blend in with your other stuffed animal friends. Weird. So, that's a wolf suit? What are you underneath? I am what I do. A rescuer of creatures in need. Just like you. Why do I have to be the one to choose who to rescue? A boy your age just has good instincts for the job. Ah. Uh ha. -huh. I'd better get back to the mission. Yes. Our window of opportunity won't last forever. Oh, man. This is so shady. I don't like it. This is very shady. I'm watching you, man. I'm watching you. The helpless creatures we rescued are being quarantined in there. Wish I could let them out. But it's for their own safety, I guess. Judging by the wolf hair, this must be where Merrick sleeps. He's gonna eat him! He's gonna eat the dudes! That should be for acting. Acting like I cared about the stupid missions on this ship. Wish he'd get rid of these. My paper mache is so much better than that now. She bronzed my first space shoes. Or is that the remains of my old bomb squad mm. bot? Mm. I gave up making art years ago. And if no one's around to see it, who cares? How did I manage to win second place that time? I think that's the ratty old washcloth I used to drag around the spaceship. I really hope she washed that thing. I wonder what's in those creepy jars. My old teeth? Hair? Mom, um, that's creepy. I made a hexy pal out of a paper plate. Probably thought they were alive then. What you looking at? Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? <gasps> I mean, you may. I just... Hey, my... My head. What's wrong? My head is smaller. Oh, uh, yeah. You just used a teleporter. Why did my head shrink? Quantum physics. Duh. Don't worry. It'll all go back to normal when you take the trip back through me. Big baby. Why is my head small? smaller? Did it really get smaller? Alright, well, okay. Red means teleporter. Um. That probably means big fancy rock. That's probably upstairs. Teleporter, activate. To the starboard passageway, sir. Oh yeah, let's go. Not responsible for lost items, motion sickness, or mutation. Dude, this lady. This lady's crazy. All right, for all this running around stuff. Whoa. Okay, now my head is just getting. Whoa. Ridiculous. Oh boy, you went through two teleporters without a return trip, didn't you? You're playing with fire, kid. What happens if I go through three? Is there 3D things up here? Objects placed into this trash chute will be jettisoned from the ship. And the next time it happens to one of your toys, Shay, your father is not going to retrieve it for you. Huh. Lol. You crawl into something once when you're two years old and they lock it forever.
Whoa. Oh no, don't even think it. What? You are banned from this rail for life, young man. Life. Your passengers are still in grief counseling. Please leave before they see. Can't I ride the train again? Banned for life. Man, they don't mess around here. Can I go this way? Man, I guess not. I messed up. I want to ride the train more. All right, I'm gonna probably cut it off here, guys. Um, thank you. First of all, thank you for watching. Uh, it's been, it's been this is a really cool game. I'm really I'm incredibly happy with the art design. Um, still going forward. I don't like that wolf guy at all. We'll we'll see if something happens with that along the way. I'm just ugh. anyway, yes. All right, I can check you out. Thank you, super. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you liked it, I guess hit subscribe and see more stuff like this in the future. And I hope you have an awesome day. Thank you.